Hello, this is a mic check. Uh, it blinks red. Uh, we got some sand from Red Rock. Is that how we start a video? No, but it's how I'm gonna start it. All right, you want to introduce yourself? I'm Riley, and this is my dad, Russell. Oh, what's up, everybody? Russ from rwgresearch.com. Uh, do you know what today is? Sunday? Today is mission day. Oh, yes. I gave our, you don't get that everywhere. I gave ourselves two hours to build something I'd never seen before. Maybe somebody's built one, but I didn't want to even look because I had a cool idea and I thought, let's try to build that. And then we'll look after we're done and see if anybody else has done it. Because I wanted some just of our own thoughts and uh, figure out what we're doing here. So what I decided I want to try to do is I would like to build a sand wall. A what? Sand wall. Just like a water wall. A, a sand water waterfall. Yeah. Like a waterfall wall that you see in a house but made out of sand. But ours won't be vertical so you can't really hang it on the wall. It has to have some angle to it. However, that's what we're going to try to do. So I'm giving ourselves two hours and I'm going to film it with this camera, which I just picked up uh, from a gentleman and we're going to see if it works. So I'm using it to GoPro. Let's see what happens. Are you ready? Yeah. All right. Let's start my timer. It's been one, actually it hasn't been one minute because we were just introducing. <laughs> we get two hours to see what we can create. Ooh, sorry, Dad. Hello. Hey, Raleigh. Okay, our two hour timer is ticking. All right. Leave that there. Uh, let's just put this right here for now. So here's the plan. Here's what I thought would be the plan. We're gonna get some wood and we're gonna make like a tray about this long you know and then we're gonna just put some tape in it so we don't have to try to seal it up and then we'll have to build a little bucket at the bottom of some kind maybe we could use a plastic bucket just to make it work one of the I have plastic buckets like the one you had in there get it out of there <clears throat> the uh, yeah. big yeah the big buckets out of there the big that we should uh, try to come up with here egg carton mama was cooking some breakfast so we got an egg carton and I just lightly cut it out I thought that should work pretty good we got these little points which are on the bottom and then we got these bigger scoops which are on the top and then the idea was to fasten them like this and it comes around and scoops the sand up and then bring it to the top and dump it this is a pretty big bell we really need a really skinny Skinny bell. We might be able to make something. Make a bell out of something. So we thought about using an auger, and I probably have something, but we're going to start out with a belt. I think it's actually going to be more complicated.
Okay. We have 52 minutes left. Camera's making noise. 52 minutes left. We almost got the belt made. We got the wooden trough made. We got our little other things made, and I got to figure out something to keep it in place. I We're almost there. I think we'll be able to get it done. Forty uh, an hour and forty five minutes, Riley. What are we doing? Building a sand. No, I mean like, what are we doing? Building these arms. What for? So the sand can pass them. And go around it and stuff. I think you can go in like. So this. here's our apparatus. It is moving, and it's running on twelve volts. So we can power this off of the sun, solar power outside. I don't know if it's still working, but we'll go out there and try it. So we got fifteen minutes to test and get everything figured out. Let me stop this thing so we don't break it. You can rip literally. The sand will be dumped right up there. I like how that one has Okay, a nice. I guess we're going outside. I'm not going to go out to the back and wire it up to the solar panel. Battery for now, I guess, and we'll hook up solar panel last. Daddy, I'll back up front. I'll back. This is ridiculous. We made a sand wall in two hours. Hi, Polly. Well, Riley, I'm impressed with this battery. It's been running for an hour and 50 minutes. Do not pour the sand in this, if you know what I mean. All right, I'm gonna put a fresh battery in this. Just fill it up. I'll leave it like this for a moment. Okay. So this is what they built. Hot glued rocks and sand and shells. And then this is <laughs> this Wait, is you guys are making egg it? carton. No, this is the sand we got from Red Dad Rock last made it night. Daddy so burned his hand off the hot glue broom. Mm -hmm. Well, we need to put some lavender oil on it. And he said he mm -hmm. lavender oil on the burn ring. Yeah, or is it? In the bathroom. Mm -hmm. Sand all over the bearings, that it'll lock them up. Mm. Is that working? Look how much sand it's picking up too. So we need to put we need to put a piece of wood right there, huh? To keep all that sand up in the in there. Cause look at the sand now, it's really going. The sand's so soft. It is working though doing what we want we can play around with the angle then once we get we'll get a piece of let's go get a piece of wood and we can shove it in there kind of need to take it out and dump the sand out and put it back in so we need to cover up these because it's running off the edges and we need to put it something right there 
Hey, we can still see it really well too. But it's working. Okay, we succeeded in our goal now for the two hour. But we're gonna make a few adjustments. Malachi's gonna break Sorry. it. And then we'll hook it up to the solar panel, but it's not very much sun, but there should be at least 12 volts coming off that thing. Just gotta hold it so that way it picks up more sand. Okay. So let's get a let's go get some wood and do it. So I'm gonna take this off, put all the sand back in the buckets, and then we'll reset and try it. Sure. The ride have stopped. All right, we'll be back in a minute. This is awesome. Okay, we made a bucket for the sand down here so that it would stay at least where it's supposed to be. Now the problem, or the what we need to do is make sure this thing has just the right amount of sand when it's actually working. Because we don't want to cover the bearings. Try not to get it in the bearings. You know, just ruin everything. They're going to probably go poopy anyway. <laughs> They're almost picking it up. <gasps> it touched it. <laughs> it just got a little bit in. Yep. Exactly. That's the point. What'd you just say? <laughs> I don't know. Like I can't water remember. buckets, but it's sand buckets. What'd she say? Like water buckets, but it's sand buckets. That's the point. We're making a sand wall water. Yeah, a water wall. It is working. It's doing it. Look, it's coming all the way back to the buckets now. Yay! It's finally going off that edge. That's what we wanted to see. When it scoops it, it, it keeps keeps it flowing down into the buckets. That's mm. what I wanted to see. That is so cool and funny. Whoa! When it like stops it, you watch. When it like stops, you go like... It like builds up. So cool. What? Well, that was so... so yeah. Daddy, you know how it stops and it just like builds up? It goes like, stop, er? Right, that's what stop, we wanted. Er? That's what we wanted. Stop, er? Right, it's I'm so gonna, satisfying. I'm capture the... See, it's getting to the bottom. Why is it going to go for hours? All right, now you know what we need to do? What? Hook it up to the solar panel. Yeah. That's the last step. So let's do that. Well, all the children are eating lunch. I'm out here as I do, slaving until the end. Dexter's with me, though. So we hooked it up to the solar panel. Remember, this is hooked up to the pool. It's still hooked up. The solar power panel tried to rip itself off the roof that day. But we got a wire. No more battery. We're hooked up right to the solar panel and it's working. So as we scoop it, it brings some out and then our little waterfall runs the same down. It's not quite what I was envisioning, but yet it's still working. Okay. I think if we had a really long one, I think it would be like really long. So this is heat shrink tubing egg carton parts took some overbands and cut them and made them this size and then hot glued them so that it would keep the belt in the middle uh, we got a gear motor out of something a belt I think you actually gave me that belt out of something I think I had the part and then uh, we just strapped it on there and hooked it up to the solar power as long as we don't get sand in here there's already a little bit of sand floating around works really well There's a hair stuck in there. It's funny. So it's it is doing what I envisioned it, but more so down here than up there. So this is really what I was looking for, like a water a water flowing. Yeah. Just doing it right there a little bit. Yeah, really, right here is like a perfect example of what I was looking for. I'm so happy with this result. Look what we built. <laughs>